you know what, it's okay. Top 30 is okay. And um, I started progressing okay. and going further in the competition and I was really proud of that as well. And then I made it through to the top 16 and it hit social media. It all started because of my name. People were not happy that my name is Chidima and I am representing South Africa. So that is where it actually really started. And you know, people felt like, well, South Africans felt like I wasn't South African enough because of my name. And um, it was really sad to see. It was a very horrible experience and I wouldn't wish it on anybody because I have lived there for 23 years. And it's, it's heartbreaking to see that I wasn't welcomed and accepted. Um, yeah. <sighs> okay. Well, you are welcome here. But you're welcome we here. <laughs> and you're the queen. Yes. Um, yes. Yeah. I just didn't want to talk about it. But yeah, yeah it, it, it's heartbreaking. It's really heartbreaking. And um, um, there were certain things that happened behind the scene that actually um, made me withdraw. And it was so heartbreaking to see that I had to withdraw close to the finale. Okay. And um, But a decision had to be made. And um, it really hit social media as well. Yeah. And um, there was some statements that came out from Home Affairs with regards to my mom's um, ID as well and that is still a legal matter so I'm not going to comment on that but what I do know is that I was born in South Africa and I am a South African and I'm still proudly Nigerian as well and I was really excited to get an invitation from Silverbird to represent Nigeria in the Miss Universe Nigeria um, to see that they saw that potential and the love that I've received, it has been exceptional, not mm -hmm. only from the group, from the organization, from the girls, but from Nigeria as well and all over the world. And that's my whole journey. Oh. Fantastic. How people reacted. I am from South Africa and I've supported Chile during her time as Miss South Africa. And when people started being mean to her and forced her to resign, I said that she will win Miss Universe Nigeria 2024. And the same fool and idiot that was rude to her we come to celebrate with her. Someone said, I am not from Nigeria, I am not from South Africa, but I am Africa. Africa love you, Chidima. We love you, Miss Universe Nigeria. Wishing you all the success that you deserve, all the way to Miss World Universe competition in Mexico. Someone has said, When she started to cry, my heart sank and shattered into pieces. Hey, yeah. Someone has said, well done Chidema Adesina, you are beautiful, created by the Most High God. We love you from the Gambia. Wow. Congratulations from Sierra Leone. Thank you, Nigeria. Someone said, keep soaring like an eagle, my beautiful Chichi. Your DNA and ancestral home is Nigeria. Embrace it. Any child born to one or both Nigerian parents in any foreign country is automatically a Nigerian. You are a Nigerian and a Nigerian at bed. This is your home and our citizenship can never be revoked. Nigerian in the diaspora are the most powerful diasporans in Nigeria and among the powerful and the most in the world. You mean yourself in it. You have more opportunities of success globally with Nigeria than South Africa. Trust me on this. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching today's video. As always, do it to subscribe and turn your post notification on so you'll be the first to know whenever I put out a new video. And please give this video a massive thumbs up. Thank you so much. I will see you in my next one. I love you all. Bye.